Sego Mini. Miso's Bakery. Time to get baking. Miso put some flour and salt in a bowl. Miso put some milk and butter in a bowl. Miso put some eggs and sugar in a bowl. Next, she mixes the ingredients with a whisk. Next, she mixes the ingredients with a lollipop. Next, she mixes the ingredients with a spoon. The cupcakes go into the oven. The cinnamon buns go into the oven. The cookies go into the oven. They look so tasty that she eats them all. Next, Miso bakes a cake. Next, Miso bakes a pie. Next, Miso bakes raisin bread. She's still hungry, so she eats it too. Uh-oh, now Miso has nothing to sell. Don't worry, Miso, your friends will help you bake more. Now there are treats for everyone. Sometimes making food can be messy. Wash your hands before and after baking. Acorn's birthday surprise. Acorn has to work on his birthday. He wishes he could have a party instead. Good morning, Acorn. It's time to start baking, says Miso. They follow a recipe that Miso found in a recipe box. They follow a recipe that Miso found on the internet. They follow a recipe that Miso found in a cookbook. Acorn wonders whether anyone will remember that today is his birthday. Miso and Acorn measure the ingredients. Miso and Acorn pour the ingredients. Miso and Acorn mix the ingredients. Miso and Acorn Add the ingredients. Next, they pour the batter into a circle-shaped pan. Next, they pour the batter into a heart-shaped pan. Next, they pour the batter into a rectangle-shaped pan. Next, they pour the batter into a square-shaped pan. Time to put the pan in the hot oven. Acorn is having so much fun baking that he forgets all about his birthday. Rain, rain, rain. Acorn runs to answer the bakery telephone. Miso takes the cake out of the oven. It's fluffy and brown inside. It's fluffy and golden inside. It's fluffy and green inside. It's fluffy and marbled inside. Miso decorates the cake with yummy sprinkles. Miso decorates the cake with yummy berries. Miso decorates the cake with yummy frosting. Miso decorates the cake with yummy chocolate curls. Surprise! Happy birthday, Acorn! Your friends have arrived for the party. Hmm, maybe it's not so bad to work on my birthday after all, says Acorn. A recipe is a list of instructions and ingredients for making food. What is this triangle-shaped snack?
Onigiri. Japanese rice balls that are made into fun shapes. What snack are they making? Fairy bread. An Australian snack of buttered bread and colorful sprinkles. What's on the grill? Jerk chicken, a Jamaican dish of grilled chicken with a hot spice mixture. What is this dough for? Arepa, fried cornmeal pocket sandwiches from South America. What are all those vegetables for? Gazpacho, a cold vegetable soup from Spain. No more noodles! Uh-oh, we're out of noodles! Let's go to the grocery store! Harvey pushes the cart. Harvey pushes the stroller. Harvey pushes the wagon. Robin looks for sprinkles. Robin looks for marshmallows. Robin looks for bird seed. Uh-oh, where's Robin? There she is. Harvey finds the milk. Harvey finds the cheese. Harvey finds the tofu. Time for a mini dance break. Let's go pay. Let's load the groceries in the car. Let's load the groceries in the bike. Let's load the groceries in the basket. Time to unpack. These cupcakes are delicious, but... We forgot the noodles! Yippee! Let's go back to the grocery store. It's important to measure the correct amount of each ingredient. If you don't, the food won't taste quite right. Get well soon, soup. Acorn is homesick with a cold. He's sad that he can't go outside to play. Miso wants to help. I'll make some soup to help Acorn feel better. She finds a recipe for noodle soup and puts on her apron. It's time to get cooking! She gathers some vegetables, including onions, to add to the soup. She gathers some vegetables, including celery, to add to the soup. She gathers some vegetables, including carrots, to add to the soup. With a sharp knife, Miso carefully chops up the ingredients into little pieces. She adds the vegetables to a big pot on the hot stove. This soup is going to be delicious! Next, Miso measures two cups of water and adds it to the pot. Now it's time for the noodles. Miso adds noodles shaped like hearts. Now it's time for the noodles. Miso adds noodles shaped like socks. Now it's time for the noodles. Miso adds noodles shaped like letters. Miso shakes some salt and pepper into the pot to add more flavor to the soup.
She stirs the soup with a wooden spoon, mixing all the ingredients together. As a special surprise, Miso adds one tablespoon of sunflower seeds, Acorn's favorite. The soup is ready. Miso delivers the soup and a homemade card to Acorn's house. When Acorn tastes the soup, it warms him up from the tip of his tail to the top of his ears. He feels better already. Acorn calls Miso to thank her for the delicious soup and for being such a good friend, too. The End Sego Mini